Welcome to video 8.2e, more on similar triangles. So here's example 8. Triangle ADE is similar to triangle ABC with these dimensions. Find uh, X. Once again, um, I just like to say small triangle over big triangle. So small triangle over big triangle. And let's see if I can get some kind of corresponding ratio. Um, all right, so I've got x is to x plus 5. Okay, um, I could also say, hey, small over big is that to that. 6 over that would be x plus 7 plus 6, x plus 13. I'll just make a note of that. All right, I now have a proportion in one variable. I can solve it by cross multiplying. I will get a quadratic factoring solving like that. So I'll just cross multiply. So x times x plus 13 equals 6 times x plus 5. x squared plus 13x equals 6x plus 30. Let's subtract 6x, subtract 6x, subtract 30, subtract 30, and get x squared plus 7x minus 30 equals 0. That's standard form. Now you want to hope that it's factorable. Two numbers with that product and that sum. Uh, let's see here. If you want, you can make a list. 130, 215. Oh, 310 looks promising. I want it to be more positive, so x plus 10 times x minus 3 equals 0. If you want to do a check, I do the OI check. That's 10x, that's minus 3x. That's some 7x, so that's looking good. Then what you want to do is chunk it and set each chunk equal to 0. So then I'm going to get x sub 1 equals negative 10, x sub 2 equals positive 3. Um, it's not that x can't be negative, it's the side length can't be. So in this case, x you know can't be negative 10, so be gone. Let's make sure that 3 makes sense, positive. Uh, positive looking good. So they said find x, so x is just 3. So there you have it, uh, another example on solving similar triangles with a quadratic.